I'm back! How you guys doing? I just got back from a vacation, but we are ready to get back into the full swing of things. I'm just taking a little a little moment to uh, catch this wild genesect I found here, you know, just chilling. <laughs> oh, Master Ball, yeah, I had no chance of catching this thing otherwise. But look at what someone made for me. It is glorious. No go. But yes. Don't you have one already? Shh. Don't worry about it. Okay, so I may have already had a Genesect, but this was the first legendary I found on the server. I wanted to catch it, okay? Plus, we color coordinate around here. Genesect in the purple Pokeball. But anyway, I just feel like chatting with you guys today. So we're going to do a couple, uh, you know, basic Pixelmon things on my Pixelmon server here that you guys can also join. My IP is right on the top of the screen. Links are in the description below. You know, you know all that stuff. So feel free to hop on and join. We're going to be battling a few people on the server. So it's going to be a, a good little challenge because, well, they're, they're probably going to dominate me because these people play a lot and they're very good at the game. But I'm Zylo. I have plot armor. So I shall reign supreme. Hopefully. Hopefully. At least I should be able to beat a gym today. And if I do, I'm going to reward myself by opening up this ultimate crate key later. So we'll do that. You have 11 days worth of flight tokens? Nice. I can fly inevitably. Since I, I got my special rank. Anyway, enough about all this nonsense. How you guys doing? Hopefully you're all having a good time, having a good week. I tried to make sure that you have almost daily videos while I was gone and I was pretty close to it to be honest like it's got not daily when I uh, slowly you know got back into the swing of things I think now after today I'll be fully back in the swing of things but you know just a nice chill video I don't have a Riolu I think uh, we're due for that hey I want to catch you all right I don't think our oh I'm out of moves out here we should heal up our Pokemon all right but yeah, I'm just going to circle a lot. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to circle a lot in the conversations. It's fine. But, ah, no! But I'm excited. I'm excited to get back into FTO. We got a couple big plans. Um, should I spoil any of it? I'll probably spoil it on my live stream anyway. I know uh, we got some S-Class trials that Lofo is going to want to start up soon. And that should be fun. Also, Lofo is currently skinny, which is interesting. So, that's another thing. I should have thrown a great ball at this thing. It's blue. We gotta color coat these Pokeballs. And then some other bigger secret stuff that I don't want to go too much into. But lots of good exciting things happening. I should have quick balled as well. Look at me not paying attention. I also have no plan on, like, what I'm doing. Well, I have a little bit of plan on what I'm doing in here. Not much of a plan on what I want to talk about. But vacation was nice. Got to relax for a week. Hang out with Kayla, Mitch, Pat, right? It was good stuff. And, uh, yeah. Riolo, just get caught, man. To be fair, I think Riolo has, like, a really low catch rate, so that's fine. But, yes, we're going to fight the, uh, gym. What egg group is Tool Cannon? Um, flying smart. Alright, let's see if we can hit this thing with a water gun and not kill it. Okay, we killed it. That's fine. That's <laughs> fine. It's perfectly fine. Um, oh, this Genesect had an item on it? A shock drive. That's cool. Um, I guess I should take a look at this Genesect. It has defense, special attack, and special defense. I don't know if that's what you want, but actually, to be fair, if it is a special attacker, which I don't know, then this is a great nature for it. Look at that. I don't know enough about Genesect. There's a lot of Pokemon that I just don't know a lot about. There's a lot of Pokemon I know tremendous amounts about. Um, but, you know, that's cool. But yeah, someone mentioned earlier I have a Genesect already because I opened up a shiny bug token and got a Genesect from it. Because it's a bug type. So, we have a shiny one right there. So, that's pretty cool. I just want to catch a legendary, you know. You know how it is. Um, but let's let's get to challenging a gym. And then we'll talk about some of the other some of the other update-ish stuff. Uh, so, Poke Heal. Thank you, VIP rank. And... Warp Gym 1. Da -da 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 -da. I'm not going to sing the whole song. I get copyrighted instantly. Let's see. Oh, another thing people probably want an update about is I did say I was going to release Rise, the uh, the song from Origins of Olympus, um, at the end of Oct or at the end of September, and it's not out yet. It's not done yet. That's the short answer of it. And you know I want to make it really good, so I'm, I'm working on. I'm working. Oh, welcome Green Vault. Got a couple new players hopping on today. Awesome, awesome. Once again, 
you guys know where to find me on here. Plus, I live stream on here a bunch, even if it's not playing Pokemon, I just chat. I just chat a lot with people. As you can see, all my Pokemon are level 25. I haven't gotten very far yet. But I think after we're, we start, like, crushing through the gym, I wanted to make the first gym battle special. After that, I think we're going to be good to, like, start leveling up. Because people... People are talking on here. They they're forgetting. They're forgetting Xylo, winner of 23 Pixelmon Islands. You know, that's an exaggeration, but still. All right, so let's see how we do this. Normal, the Rubble Gym. So it's a Rock type gym. So I have a Water type. Well, I have two Water types and a Ground type Pokemon. I don't have a Grass type, but I think we should be fine. These are two, three really good Pokemon. Um, so join the queue. Standard rules. Blah 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 blah. Let's do it. Currently, it's NPC battles, um, so we will get this going. Select team. Oh, you can look through your whole PC like this? That's neat. Well, we're going to select these three. Uh, that looks good. Rubble Gym, leader NPC, start battle. That's a cool little screen. I didn't know this popped up. And, okay, let's do it. Welcome to the Rubble Gym. Good luck and have fun. All right, Dreadnought is going to be my first Pokemon. We are fighting a Lilip. This, I believe, is this a water? Ooh. Ooh. This might be a water rock Pokemon. I know it's a fossil-y thing. Um, well, we're gonna have to test it out. Let's go with a water gun, because if it's a rock type, it's probably very good physically defensive. So, eh? Oh, oh no! <laughs> Giga Drain destroyed me! Alright, um, wow. That is a, an int am I about to lose my battle? Okay, so water does nothing against the leap. Is it grass type? I don't know what it is. Bonering here. We oh no! Oh wait, no, it did a little bit, but it's gonna just giga drain me out of existence here. Okay, so the gyms are serious. They playing like this, huh? Okay, we're about to get decimated in my first gym battle. I'm embarrassed. <laughs> I'm a little embarrassed. Uh, I'm gonna just look up what the leap is. I think it must be grass rock, right? Yeah. It's totally good. Yep, it's Grass Rock. What is good against Grass Rock? I don't know. Ice won't be good against it. Yeah, it's decent, but I'm just getting decimated. Oh, man. All right. Well, shh. You don't, you don't gotta tell me. Please don't tell me to broadcast that for everyone to see. Then I'll be real embarrassed. Remember what I said? I was like the winner of 23 Pixelmon Islands. Um. Well, hmm. <laughs> okay. So, what is a leap weak against? Oh, this thing might have storm drain too. No wonder my water did nothing. Well, it, my water did nothing to it because it's a grass type. That's what it is. All right, we're doing our research right here. We're doing very intense research. All right, this thing is defensive in both ways. Um, its damage shouldn't be crazy, but all my Pokemon are weak to it. So yeah, ice is good against it. Bug, steel fighting. So if I can get my hands on a fighting Pokemon, that would probably be a really good way to handle it. Um, well, actually, I don't know. Any of those would be a good way to handle it. Let's, uh, <laughs> let's go home. I worked on my home a little bit. You guys want to see? It's a bridge! We got this. It goes into this cave over here. Ah, uh, level 34. I need level 25s for this gym. So I made a nice little bridge out of acacia. A little design with some, uh... Some stone brick and a nice dark wood frame on there. You know, I like making me some curved bridges. Then I realize these are at two different levels. But that kind of adds to the appeal of it. And then inside, we have couches and a dragon head. Very fancy stuff. Very fancy stuff. Let's see. You trying to lure me into a dark cave? What up? Yeah, I didn't think so. All right, so we just we just wrecked our, ourselves. Um, let's look through my PC and see what I have that might be able to do something here, because yikes, I played myself. Um, pfft. okay, so what I want, fighting? I have big fan Zylo. Um, ice? Dugong? Uh, too high level. So even Seal's too high level. That's sad. I'm just sad, because I wasn't expecting to lose so drastically. <laughs> oh gosh, I'm bad at Pokemon now? Oh, I mean, we have a Stunky, but that shouldn't be very uh, great against any of it. Um, we got Rexy, nice level 100 someone sent me. Um, the True God Magikarp. We got a Larvitar, but that's not really the answer either. Oh, gosh. <sighs> yeah, Bugger Ice really would be the right answer. 
We got Anubis here. Hmm. Steel, though. Ooh, a Corbin. Hmm. As rock, though. But then again. So, Corviknight is a new Pokemon that I kind of want to try out some new stuff. So, that might be a good answer. Oh, here's one of the starters. That's cool. We could do a Heracross. Um, but once again, a rock move would just wreck me. So, I'm actually leading Ice or Steel if we're going to take something against it. Um, my Steelix is way too high a level. Um, man. Wow. I just don't have the Pokemon for it. We could set up a Heracross, potentially. And... If Beldum can get a steel move, that might be the answer as well. Ooh, Shelter. This is actually a really good Shelter. Um, someone had sent me. I love how all my Pokemon are just stuff that people sent me. Alright, you know what? We are going to put something in a Wonder Trade and see if we get lucky. I have two Kangaskhans. Um, I have a Phantump. Nice. Do I have any other Pokemon here? Not particularly. So, let's throw in... You know, let's throw in a Shiny. Let's throw in a Shiny. No, <laughs> battle me, it's Kate. Alright, Kate, we're gonna put your shiny in here. Thank you, but I don't need y'all handouts. Wonder trade. Trade. Bow. And I got- Oh! Oh. I, I saw, like, shiny twice, and I was like, did I just get a shiny for a shiny? And it, I got a um, Magikarp, is what I got. I, I have a Magikarp. A special attacking Magikarp, as well. So, yep, that shiny is now in the Wonder trade. Let me know in the comments if you managed to get it. Um, but, yeah, we're, we're gonna need to train more Pokemon for this. Um, I don't think we can get a steel move on Beldum. I will look up when Beldum evolves, but I think it's it's either 25 or 35. I love my, like, random Pokemon knowledge that I'm just digging back years. Let's see. Oh, no, it, levels, it evolves at 20. So, as soon as I, you know, give this thing a level, it should evolve. And hopefully it'll get a steel move. Let's do a little Rescourge. And it will get a steel move at probably level. Where's the charts? Man, shouldn't be doing this during videos. I'm just being lazy here. But, you know, I've been lazy for the past week, you know. Taking a break. Vacation and all that. So, you know. Okay, well, it's just not It's just not here. You know, we'll look at Metang. Because I don't think Beldum gets any moves, period. So there wouldn't be any move charts. Okay, there's none on here either. Thanks, Bulbapedia. Just because you're the first search result doesn't mean I have to... You know what? We'll just try it. We'll just try it. That's fine. Um, And then Heracross has a potential. But honestly, like the other Pokemon should be fine. They should be. Hmm. It's interesting. It's interesting. Well, we need a little, we need a little practice first. So we're going to battle some other people. Who's got a good arena? We're going to fight. We'll do three Pokemon. I'm bringing the Carcoal in here. Um, we'll keep these guys in the PC for a name. You can use the one at Warp Arena. I know, but some people got some cool builds. Um, do we leave Cubone? Yeah, I guess we should leave a Water Pokemon out. Um, okay, let's bring Dreadnought to the battles, and we'll bring Orlando to the gym. That sounds good, so we're using two fresh Pokemon. Level 25. No items. Lego. Uh, yeah, sure. We're going to... Sure, we'll do a one at the Warp Arena. Let's go. Who's first? We gotta go up here. All right. Dun 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 dun. Make sure my Pokemon are all healed up, and we got that going for us. Alrighty, this will be fun. Who do we start with? Um, I guess. Hmm, Cuba might be the most offensive Pokemon. Uh, gosh. Maybe we start with this. Yeah, and then we have a potential rapid spin job as well. Alright, let's go, Nightwolf. I'll throw first. Guess I should have thrown something else, but let's do it. Alright, except. Let's go. So he's got a Swablu to start things off with. Okay, I have Smackdown, which might be very good, and I don't know what he would have good against me. Um, I also have Ancient Power, which could be excellent. Um, and it could boost my stats. We'll try that out. Hey, Super effective. Let's see. He has Astonish. Yeah, terrible move. Um, fortunately, Karkul has some decent moves on him. Nothing crazy good, um, but enough. Okay, so Swablu's down. Good to see. Alright, Gengar. Ooh, good choice against me. Okay. 
Do we go for a flame charge? What is a Gengar going to have against me? Do I have any obvious switch? No. <laughs> the answer is no. So let's just uh, stick this. I think my Dreadnought has Bite on it. Or it might be. I th might be thinking of the other one. So let's try it. Ooh, Confuse Ray. That's clever. Not bad, not bad. We'll see if Carcoal can get through it. Come on, Carcoal. Keep on wheeling out. I love how it's a little, it's a little minecart full of coal. That's what it is. All right, I hurt myself with confusion. I want to get some flame charge so we can get a Carcoal um, rush here. Ooh, we got it with the burn. Although, well, it just sucker punched me. So, ooh, but I can't use flame charge again. Okay, interesting. Hmm. Nightshade. Not the best move at level 25, because I think Nightshade does the amount of damage um, your health is, which, funny enough, would have been one more hit to finish me. And then Toracat. Alright, I think this is the evolved form of the uh, starter. And since I boosted my speed, we got a Carcoal Sweep, baby! Woo! GG. Alright, let's heal up, and then we'll uh, do a little trick and send out Dreadnought first. So let's see if we can win three battles. Alright, who's next? Who's next? Let's go. Let's go. These guys are just itching for me to get some hundreds just so they can crush me with them. But I'm like, no, yeah, what 25s, please? Oh, oh no, I got mail. Oh, wait, no, this is a Asia flu. Oh, I have no idea what legendary this gets me. We have our next battle. Lizardry. All right. Okay, he's done some battle rules. Hopefully, um, he doesn't have a bunch of heavily trained Pokemon. Because then I'll get crushed. But we will see. We will see. Proposing rules. Um, there we go. So it might be a level cap team, but either way, let's go. I'll need to select. I uh, will start off with you this time, and let's go. So Jellicent is first. As we predicted, someone might try to bring something like that. Um, but that doesn't mean I'm good against it with Dreadnought. Wait, I have Bite. Excellent. I do have Bite. Yes! Super effective. Twisted the Dimensions. Is that Trick Room? I didn't even see the move. Um, he's maybe going for a switch now, or maybe a sacrifice play. I think Razor Shell might be either, but Bite's the safer play. Toxic? Okay. Yeah, I think that might be a Trick Room play. Okay, interesting. So we're gonna see a Shedinja. Is this the one that's, like, only weak against, like, two things? Well, I have a Rock move, which I'm sure it is weak against. Yeah, we get there. Alright. Yo, are we having another one Pokemon sweep? Mimikyu. Um, that's definitely a ghost, right? So, oh, did I just, I used rock too much. <laughs> I meant to use that. Um, he swords danced, but I'm all poisoned up. Let's try to bite it. Oh, no. It's not a, I didn't know what its disguise was, I'll be honest. Um, let's just try to hit it hard with the, yeah, Shadow Sneak, smart move. Okay, um, Mimikyu. That is ghost and something let's just try to hit a hard with cubone or no let's bring carcoal back out we'll keep cubone a secret to the audience here um flame charge can't be bad oh gosh that was a powerful shadow claw let's hope i have the speed now unless it is a trick room team um boy oh yeah yeah shadow sneak jeez this mimic you all right boner ring let's go This thing is destroying. See, Mimikyu's is one I also don't know a ton about. I think I used it once in a tournament and it crushed. Um, oh yeah, that was in Poke Couples. Play rough. Okay, so it is fairy type, I'm pretty sure. Oh, we got it just barely. And a crit, too. GG. That was nice. Okay. So, not a uh, one Pokemon sweep. Alright. One more battle. Let's go. Who's next? You next? Alright, Psycho. Yes. Let's do it. Oh, gosh, what is that thing? Uh, looks like an electric bug. I don't know. Oh, man. Why am I bad at Pokemon? Ooh, he did not heal. I will take full advantage of this then. Um, Vi Vikavolt? Yes. I probably would have killed him either way. He's a bug. Um, ooh, okay, so this is an ice rock type Amar. It's one of the fossils, I believe. So none of my moves are going to be exceptionally good against it, but it shouldn't be exceptionally good against me either. Once I get Cubone out here, it should shred. 
Um, but let's just... Why did I think a water move wouldn't be good against a rock type? What's what's up with my brain? I think Xylu is bad at Pokemon now. I think it happened. I, th I mean, sure, we're winning battles here, but these people, you know, I just threw rules at them, and they're just putting their teams together. They have level 100 stuff. And... Ooh, okay, that's a bit of a sandstorm. Actually, a water gun might do more damage. No, it did not. Okay, just because I imagine it's more physically defensive, and water gun's a special attack, but Razor Shouts does more. So, boom. GG. Anyone else? We might do one more of these battles and then go try the gym again. Although we don't really have a team. I can just wear candy up to the gym and see if we get luckier. Alright, Caleb. You're the last one. Oh gosh, that's a level 25 Caesar? Okay. Uh, are those 25? <laughs> that's a rare thing to see. All right. Okay, he says. He says they are level twenty-five Caesar. We'll take it. Um, we got to go right for a flame charge. Bullet punch, great move against me. He did burn himself. We didn't take out a Caesar with a fire move. Oh gosh. So he's going for a bullet punch. Um, I don't have anything that's gonna just tank it outright. I guess Dreadnought might be okay. Let's do that. Oh, man, not bad at all. Okay, um, let's go for... Yeah, nothing particularly here is fantastic, and it's going to die to the burn anyway. So, man. She has an Aerodactyl. Ooh, that might just outpace me and finish me. It didn't. Okay, great. Big power on my Dreadnought. And Cloyster. Ooh, this will be interesting. Jeez, okay, this man set up a team for me. All evolved Pokemon. <sighs> Cubone, it might work. I have a weak team against this Cloyster. Alright, um... <sighs> Neither of these moves are great. I think we'll just hit him with a flame charge, I don't know. Okay, yeah, we went down anyway. He's burned, which is great, because he does big damage, but no surprise, a water move when I have a Cubone. So, Bone Ring, I'll probably hit first. Um, I'll probably deal good damage, but it won't one shot. Oh no, he hits first! Oh yeah. No, he's got me for sure. Yeah, GG. That's a big loss. Alrighty. Let's accept the battle and go. No, get the ground on off the arena! Alright, so Crabat. Oh, we do have Rock Tomb, so. Cross Poison. Not entirely good against me, and obviously a Rock Move is going to crush a Crobat. Alright. Or Cloyster, darn it! Huh. I don't know. Uh, the Shell Smash! I think the other... Oh, that's pleasant. But I'm not gonna outspeed. Oh, boy! Um, do I have a flying? No, I don't. Okay, live, dread. Oh, boy, we are so dead. We are actually so dead. We're gonna get swept by a Shell Smasher. Yep. Very nice. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we're so dead. We are so dead. Alright. Yep. Cloister. <laughs> Big weakness for these three. <laughs> nice. They are. They saw my team and adapted well. <laughs> I'll take it. Thanks for the battles. Alrighty. So, we need a gym team. I would like to grab them. So, um, we'll do that. We'll do this and that. Now, it's still like a largely predictable team. But yeah, Cloyster would be sick. Um, and I do have a shelter. I don't have a water stone, though. Yeah, I do really, I would really like to use my Cloyster. You know what? Maybe we will. Um, actually, if we lose, we'll just train up the Shelter, because it's level 1. And we only need to use, like, 5 rare candies to get Beldum up to Snuff. So, let's go home, just to get away from the crowds. Thank you for the battles, everybody. And, actually, are we allowed to use items in the gyms? Wait, no, I'm not getting on cube. Hold on. We are probably allowed to use items, and I just didn't. I also don't really have items. There we go. Evolve Beldum. 
Once again, Metagross is like my favorite Pokemon, so this is a, you know, an easy thing to do, an easy choice. That's a big looking Beldum. He's, I think you're growing a little too big, yeah, okay. Ah, I mean, the amount of metal. You stood up. There we go. Get a steel move. Oh no. Did he get one on level up? Oh yeah, look at this man. All right, yeah, he's sick. All right, we're good to go. So, we have our steel Pokemon. Can it beat a Lilip? Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Um, oh, what is this? A Aerodactylite. I guess someone left that as a gift for me. Nice. What kind of items do I have? A Rose Incense. A Swampertite. X Speed. Weakness Policy. Could be of some use. A Dark Gem. Could be of some use. A Psychic Gem. Could be of some use. Um, Fire Gem. Not particularly. Uh, yeah, so, oh, we could do a water stone. Okay, so we'll manage that if we fail again. I might fail again. It's very possible. And, you know, it'd be rough. It'd be rough, because then I would be more losses than wins in this, in this video. Big sad, big sad. But let's try it. All right, so, gym. Oh, I'm nervous. Yeah, without any items. Well, I guess I should put the... I guess I should put these items on my Pokemon. You have a, you have a, uh, yeah, you have confusion. Not that I know it's going to be of any, uh, result, but still. Weakness policy, we'll just put that on you. And, actually, no, you have a dark move, so we'll put a dark gem on you. We'll put the weakness policy on Cubone. Ah, oh, yes, the greatest of items. Fantastic. Fantastic. All right, to the gym. Boom. Gym. Rock. Join Q. Let's go. Oh, it's on cooldown for an, for two hours? Well, I guess it is just going to have to be done on a live stream. So sad. I got obliterated. I'm embarrassed. So I guess we went uh, for battle stay. We went three and three, which ain't, ain't passable for me. Ain't passable. I don't know. That's big sad. Does that even warrant me using the ultimate crate key? I think so. I don't know. But hopefully you guys are still around. For the uh you know discussion about things so what do we talk about talked about a little bit of uh, fto stuff we talked about a lot of pixelmon stuff to be honest and what else i suppose i'm getting really excited for some dnd stuff coming up because as you guys may or may not know i uh co-run a channel dice and fire we call it it does a lot of uh dnd leftovers that's a good item i'll be taking that but we do a lot of D&D uh, &D streams over on my channel, Xalophone on Twitch. And, well, it is getting a bunch of new games set up. And one of them I'm going to be running. And I'm really excited about it. Like my other monitor over here. Well, it has Pixel Mod stuff on it now. But it did have a bunch of, like, map stuff up and stuff. I'm really excited to get streaming. So, yeah. I guess if you're not following that or if you're not following my Twitch, go do that now. Go do that. Do it. Plus, that's where you'll see these streams. Look, they had got the same issue you have. Oh, no. Is there a bike somewhere? Oh, no. Not the bike. Not the bike. Hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go pick it up for them. I'm gonna be a hero. I'm gonna be a hero. Okay. I'm not gonna be a hero. <laughs> I'm not gonna be a hero. Alright. Well, let's see what we can get in this ultimate crate key at the very least. Because I want to get back to playing some D&D. And live streaming soon. If I finish this up real quick, I might be in time for another cool thing. <gasps> The crates just changed. They just changed. Like yesterday. That's a big L. How many L's can I take in one day? Ah! Um, do I, do I have any other, any other key? I was, I was saving it for a special, special moment. Oh, man. That's so sad. You know, I'm just going to take my bike and I'm just... I can't even... Oh no, guys. I think I've just lost Pokemon. I've just lost it, Pokemon. Well, I'll open up some of the other ones in my live stream. It's fine. I'll beat the gym in my live stream. It's fine. Ah, I'm bad at Pokemon now. What is this thing?